Below in the deep there's adventure and danger. That's where you'll find Diver Dan. The sights that he sees are surprising and stranger than ever you'll see on the land. The wily fish, the barret, has given Dan the slip. He's being chased round about and all through skipper ship. It seems that they will catch him. They certainly shall try, but he just might elude them. That Baron's very sly. He's escaped for good now. <laughs> What's so funny, Skipper? The Baron's escape is no laughing matter. You, who says he's escaped? Well, you just saw him go down that funnel. He didn't get very far from there. What do you mean, Skipper? That funnel is my tricky, laddie. <laughs> it narrows down to just a tiny hole. The minnow couldn't get through the other end. <laughs> Come along and see. <laughs> you won't get away this time. Curses, curses, curses! Who a diver, Dan? Will he ever meet Miss Minerva now? Seems like the perfect opportunity. Doc, what are you doing here? Didn't you know we're bringing the Barrett in for a trial? Yes, 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 but Dan, you are not bringing him in, I'm afraid. What do you mean? The rules of Neptune forbid anyone who is not a fish from attending a trial of one of us. Oh, I, I see. Well, of course, I'll abide by your rules. Hmm, I, I'd better tie up the Baron for you. He's a tricky customer. And tie him tight, Dan. Better put an extra knot in for luck. There. That should hold him. Finley, I'd better hold the pearl for you until you've delivered the Baron. When you need it as evidence, I'll be waiting right here. Right, Dan. I'm sorry about our rules. Yes, so, so am I. We have that Baron. Here he is, mean as ever. I'll report you all to King Neptune. He's a plot, underhanded and underwater. Baron Barracuda, King Neptune is well aware of your wicked ways. And you know if you show your face at his court, you'll be arrested on the spot. Look at the crowd. <laughs> ugh, ugh, me scalp him. Let's kill all of them. Everyone wants to see the Baron get what's coming to him. Now, quiet down, everybody. We must be sensible and fair about this. We don't want any mob hysteria. There's always an answer within the law. He must have a trial. Well, that's just what Diver Dan said. And we have lots of evidence, too. The shellophone, for one thing. We'll show it all at the trial. Diver Dan is holding the best evidence of all. The pearl. The pearl? pearl? The pearl! <laughs> mm, pearl. It's Ozzy's pearl. Say, Minerva, did you know Diver Dan thinks the pearl is valuable? He'd like to take it to the captain. He's holding it for us now. Since he's been so kind to us, go to Diver Dan and tell him he may show the pearl to his captain. Well, I'll go right now. But, oh my. What is it, Finley? Well, I just thought of something. What? Well, we're in a predicament. Well, how's that? Well, Diver Dan must show the pearl to his captain, right? Now, that's right. If he takes the pearl up to the captain, the captain will keep it, right? Oh, that's right. Well, if the captain has the pearl, we won't have the most important evidence for the Baron's trial. <laughs> oh, dear. And if he leaves the pearl here, then the captain will insist that he go back to the ship and they will all sail away. But the diver can take another pearl or any other valuable object. All the captain wants is something of value. Well, that's why he sent Diver Dan down here. He can have my stethoscope. I give him deep sea wampum. <laughs> Bless you all. You are all so kind. Most important thing right now is to put the wicked Baron on trial. Let's not waste any time. I'll round up a jury. But first, Miss Minerva, 
You should go over the rest of the evidence in the chest while I get the pearl from Diver Dan. Curses! You will all regret this! Well, the boss is in real trouble. Yeah, I gotta do something here. If only I could stop that creep Finley from coming back with the pearl. Dan, I've come back for the pearl. We're going to need it as evidence. Finley, I, I don't know what to do. I've been thinking it's my duty to show this pearl to the captain. After all, I was sent down here to find anything of value. You mean you won't let us have it? We need it to convict the Baron. You know I wouldn't do a thing like that. Look, I'll give you the pearl to use as evidence. As soon as the trial is over, rush it back to me so that I can take it up to the ship. Uh-oh, too late. What's wrong? It's the signal. The captain wants me right now. What'll I do? This is the evidence you need to put the Baron in jail. Still, if I don't bring up the pearl, the captain may get discouraged and sail away. I'll never see you folks again. To go up with the pearl or leave it behind. On this matter, Dan must make up his mind. What will Dan's decision be? Tune in again and you will see. He moves among creatures of frightening features. Flashing feet, flashing jaws, flapping fins, snapping claws. He protects and he saves his friends under the waves. That's where you'll find Diver Dan.